alongside Jenna Frost of the women's lacrosse team. Jenna, congratulations on today's big win. So first off, let's talk about the entire game as a whole and what you saw. Yeah, it was a really great team effort today. We went out there, took care of business with our game plan, and uh, the shooting was great from the offensive side. And when it came down to defense, we tried caused those turnovers and brought it back down. So it was a great day. Now, that is the most goals that you and your team have scored in at least one half this season. Kind of talk about the team morale going into halftime. Uh, everybody was really excited. It's exciting to get a uh, running clock at the first half, so that really helps the game. And um, it was just a great shooting day overall. Big team effort today. Your performance definitely stood out, getting 101 now career-caused turnovers. So talk about your performance with that today. Yeah, that was really exciting to hear my name announced on the loudspeaker when I got the 100th. Um, it's just a great validation, I think, for the hard work that I put in at uh, Colgate throughout my career. So it's just really exciting for me. Now looking next week to Binghamton, what are you and the team kind of preparing for? Probably just keep rolling off of this win. We're on a really strong high. So um, we're playing really great lacrosse, and it's just exciting to be out there, and we're having fun. Alongside Megan Ark of the women's lacrosse team, Megan, congratulations on today's win. Kind of talk about the team performance today. Um, it was a great team win. We really were successful everywhere on the field, on the defense, on the attack, the midfield. Our draws were really great. We really came out with some big wins on the draws that really pushed our momentum forward. You and the team came out early in the first half and really brought the momentum. Kind of what did Coach say to you guys during halftime? Uh, we just had to keep pushing. Like, yeah, we had a uh, strong lead, but we couldn't let up. We had to keep putting the goals in the uh, the ball in the back of the net, keep getting goals, keep stopping the ball on the defensive end, keep getting the draws, kind of just keep working hard so we could clinch that win. So today was a big day, not just for the team, but for you and Jenna as well. Jenna got 101 caused turnovers, and you got your 101st goals for the entire season. Kind of talk about how you're feeling right now. Um, I felt great. I did not know it was my 101 uh, career goals, so that was really exciting when they announced that. Um, it was just, it was really great. Uh, we really worked hard. I couldn't do it without the rest of my team assisting me, and kind of it was really exciting. It was good for me, and congratulations to Jenna also with her 101 cause turnovers. She's been working hard all year. So, alongside Heather Young, head women's lacrosse coach, after their big win over Lafayette, coach, congratulations on today's win. Talk about the team performance coming off very early in the first half and took the lead to get running time. Yeah, overall, obviously a huge team effort on all aspects of the um, of the game through the defense, the midfield, but offensively just awesome. To have that type of lead at halftime is huge for us. Um, they have a very great defense. Lafayette has kind of switched up their defense in the middle of the year. Um, we've watched some early games on them, and then they changed it uh, most recently, and it's been really hard for teams to get the ball in the back of the net. So for us to be, we worked on Thursday and Friday and then at practice, um, and I I'd say our best day for us was actually today during the game. We were so patient looking for those openings um, and the feeds that everybody had in, and then we were putting the ball away. It was huge. And I think we were 50% shooting in the first half, which that's awesome to have. As, as a coach, I'm very excited. Now, just in the past games, as the entire season, not just one person has scored for your team. Kind of talk about everything as, you know, Lauren Garayek has four goals and, you know, Emily Peebles has three and so on. Yeah, I mean, part of our offensive plan and part of our um, one of our motions we have is to balance out our offense. Obviously, Megan Ark is a huge threat and was a, has been a great threat for us the past couple of years. So to be able to kind of have everybody else contributing and to have our offense set up to whoever's in that spot being able to go to cage, it just opens it up. So, I mean, you try to shut down one, two of us, there's six other people that we can put in that can really step up. So I think that's been huge for us this year and part of the reason why we've been doing really well offensively. Now, speaking with Megan Ark and Jenna Frost earlier, they have now joined the 100s club for the team. Jenna getting 101 caused turnovers and Megan getting 101 goals. Kind of talk about their performance being seniors and for you. Yeah, um, we knew going into the BU game on Wednesday that they were both uh, three away, and they were obviously both one away today. So both of them getting their 100th and 100th first goal and then um, cause turnover respectively at home um, with a great crowd with um, our spring coming game was awesome. Um, I think just the performance that – 
you know, you see from Megan, she had two goals, but she had four assists. Um, you know, she's she was looking to set up her teammate. She wasn't the one going to cage to get that. Like she said, she didn't even know that it was her hundredth that she was going to get. Um, and then Jenna just has been a force for all four years. I mean, it's just huge to see a defender who's been all Patriot League since their freshman year. Um, so I couldn't be happier for the two of them. Their work ethic on the field, obviously, um, you know, definitely relates to those 100 cost turnovers, 100 goals, or 101 for both of them. Now, a bit quick of a turnaround for you and the team on Tuesday, back at home against Binghamton. What are you and the rest of the coaching staff really looking forward to watching film and really kind of seeing in this Binghamton team? So we've already started to break down film, us coaches. We never we never stop. Um, they're definitely ha- very feisty. They have a couple really good offensive players that other teams haven't been able to shut down. Um, so we'll probably get our defense really on board for that um, because we have really good matchup defenders. We did really great today with our matchups against Lafayette. So really just kind of sticking to our game plan and filling in those Binghamton attackers against our defenders. Um, but uh, as a whole, really focusing on us what we can do um, to beat them to break down their defense and how we can perform.